Hi guys, welcome back to Karamia's Corner. I'm back with a collective haul from Michael's, some items from Amazon, and Tuesday morning. So first up, will you see these three beautiful summer-themed pads, uh, paper pads. They were a hot buy at Michael's. The first one is Girls Getaway, and it has 12 different designs. So this one, I'm excited to share a project I made for a summer swap that I just sent off to my dear snail mail friend Sandra. So here is a sneak peek of that flip book. We're also doing a summer embellishment box swap. I will be posting that video soon once she receives it. So first up we're going to do a flip through of these three pads, uh, Tropic Vacation and Little Wildflower. Next, I got these pencil cases. They were $1.50 each from Michaels. Going to use them for more embellishment box swaps that I'll be sending off to some of my snail mail friends. I thought these were perfect. They don't have the compartments, but you can customize it. There are some items I want to include, but I can't put inside the box. So I thought I could use this and just format it the way I want. So I have the gray, pink, and blue. So let's have a look in box number one and see what else I got. These are buttons actually from Hobby Lobby. I'm working on a cute little project with my daughter and she loves dogs. So we also have some cute patches. Also on clearance at Michael's were these Recollections Backyard Table Paper Flowers. I love these. I previously used them in a exploding cake project that I showed you in my previous um, videos and other uh, projects for memory keeper album and then we have more of these paper flowers I love these cute little bling stickers on top and then we have them in this color so let's look at our pink box in here I found these wonderful washi tape so this one has some words on it and look how thick this is this was on clearance as well, so I got a couple of each. This one says uh, hello, and then you have cute, happy on it. A pretty thick washi roll there to another one. And then this one has some clocks, and I love that vintage feel to it. Love the pink. And then we have this one, also nice vintage looking spring washi with a bird nest and a cute bird and then i saw these adorable little keychains that would be perfect for summer it says adventure call so i thought this was super cute so now let's have a look at our third box so here i thought this would be perfect again for summer projects we have a turtle die with matching um, stamps here. So this will look awesome. There's a hummingbird there and some cool little phrases here as well. So can't wait to give this a try. And now we have these recollections. They're sticker pack and I love the summer theme. So this is what is included in this pack. This was on clearance as well. And I love foam stickers. These are perfect for summer projects. This is our flamingo. We have a toucan here. I love this bird, so cute. And we have our vintage telephone. Next, I purchased some butterfly items. 
From Recollections, these were on clearance. I love these. I like that it has that distressed look on the side. And then you have these vellum looking paper flowers that you can definitely use for layering on projects. And speaking of layering, I got this EK Tools layering punch from Amazon. So I'm excited to use this and show you how I will be applying these butterfly layers on some of my mixed media projects and some card making. I got a couple of these card sets. I love the simplicity of these cards. You can definitely spice it up and embellish it with some stamping or some of your own little doodles on it and some ephemeras and some die cuts as well. Love the pink envelope on this one. I also got some of these recipe cards. They come eight in each pack for a dollar. This is from the Target dollar spot. I am going to make a little recipe book for my daughter, Lil, who's beginning to take interest in cooking in the kitchen with me. So I thought this would be nice as a reference for her. And then from Walmart, decided to try some of these three by five index cards. I wanna use them for a memory decks uh, project that I'll be trying out soon as well. It has 48. I don't have the die. So I thought I'd use this as a template. I love the colors on the tabs as well, so I'll definitely use that. There's yellow as well. And then this little postcard booklet was on clearance. I think it was 80% off. So let's have a look and see. These would be perfect for a travel journal as an insert. You can definitely put it in a memory album. So super cute images, and I think you have five or six of each. So I like these, and then there's, I think, one more design here with the ice cream. And a week, more than a week and a half ago, it was a Tuesday morning, just came by to look at their uh, stock. I didn't really find anything that I really needed except this one. I like mini folders, so I haven't been back. I'm sure they have more new things there. This is by Pink Paisley. So I'll put the skew at the top in case you want to check and see if your Tuesday morning has it. $1.99, I just love these mini folders. So see, you can also make your own if you have the paper pad. I love notebooks, I got more of these. These are the Stitch Journal notebooks from Craftsmart. Perfect traveler's notebook inserts, I love these. So let's see, I think this one might be a blank oh these are lined ones okay so lined notebook and then we have one here with uh, the watercolor look there that's so pretty let's see if it is lined so this one's not lined I love including this in snail mail and also using it as an insert in my travelers notebook and here's one with our teal blue we have another one here I love this it reminds me of washing just paint and then we have another one with that soft blue and that silver pine apple. From their planner section, I found this on clearance, regularly $14.99. I think it was 70% off. So I love the cover. It says, get it done. And this year has been a lot about doing things and finishing up projects. So I definitely love this. I love that it's not dated, so you can definitely use it and customize it to your need. So here's what it looks like. You have a little saying in the front and you have different tabs. So see it has a monthly to do priority list and then notes. Then it continues with the same thing. We have our routine, morning, afternoon, and evening. And then you have your weekly here, which is awesome. Errands, housekeeping, and then you have to buy. I love this checklist style and appointments and so on so let's see what the next tab has so it just repeats you also have like this graph page it's, and then you have at least quite a lot and then there is a tab for lists so i like that i love to make lists and this is awesome so i can't wait to use this and definitely get stuff done more fun clearance items. We have these metal clips. I love using these as bookmarks and using them as well as embellishments for snail mail. I love the 80s. So I thought this 20 piece die cut shape is super cute and definitely be using them. So here's one with the 
balloon animal. We have a cassette tape, fun, and then we have our roller skates there. I love the wings at the end there. Also got some of these washi recollections planner tape. It's washi, I love it, panda power, and then you have some hearts there as well. Here's a closer look at that washi. It's actually a little mermaid panda. Super cute, and it says here, be a panda cord. So it's also a unicorn. We have a narwhal looking panda there, and it says panda power. Also from the clearance aisle, I got a set of these charms. I love it, perfect for the summer, and also for your traveler's notebook. Also got another set of these washi tape. I love these llamas and the flowers, and these were in clearance as well. I got a couple of these photo boxes. They were on sale for $2 at Michael's. I love these. I don't know how you guys store some of the pocket letters or letters you get from your pen pals. I definitely love to put them in here while they're folded. I have some binders where they're laid out, but some of the letters I do like to put them in these photo boxes. I also love using these boxes for organizing my craft tools and craft supplies. And finally got a bag of these beads, the wooden beads and the stem wires that I'm using again for another wire doll project. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted a picture of this adorable fairy doll. Super fun and easy to make. I found a wonderful tutorial on here on YouTube for the Untidy Crafter. So I'll put the link in the description box if you'd like to try this project. Hope you enjoyed this collective haul. Again, wishing you a wonderful summer. Thanks again for watching Caramia's Corner. See you next time.